Hey, um, good afternoon, everyone. My name is Ling Simo, and I appreciate the opportunity to be with you today. And my topic is cross soil biodiversity in natural and enterprise ecosystems. During the next five minutes, I shall share the research objectives, sampling sites, and some research of bacteria and fungi. Um, this study aims to solve the problem how do human activity impacts on soils, especially on their soil biodiversity. And the main research objective is that to estimate what is the dominant response of soil biodiversity to human activities and to analyze which microbial cluster are intolerant or tolerant of human activities and how are they distributed the, uh, phylogenetically. To achieve the goals, our study was conducted at two islands located in the southern part of Veneto. And the first one is Porto Calali, is the natural preserve and botanical gardens represent a natural ecosystem. And the other one is uh, Iceland Abalella with many accommodations, leisure facilities, and economic activities as an uh, anthropogenic ecosystem. It provides an attractive model to investigate the influence of human activities on soil biodiversity. And we study the soil of two series of vegetation under a nature, nature one and the uh, uh, anthropic ties along to the uh, forest, along to the forest to the seaside. And there are 10, ten plots was established in pairs on Abalala and Kalali respectively. Um, during the last year, we have some results and this feature shows the bacterial community composition at the feeling levels. And the sample size uh, A means the sample from Abalella, and the C means sample from uh, Kaleli, and the sample number means the uh, sample size from C to forest. And we can see the long night feeling in all soil samples were the proteal bacteria, ethyl bacteria and plankomyces. And the related abundance of bacteria in the same sample times did not seem to be very different. We also estimate the ecological process of microbial community assembly in two islands and the mechanism regulating com community assembly or into two general categories. On the one hand, the niche theories emphasizes the roles of deterministic ecological selections, which can result in the variable selections and the homogeneous selection respectively. On the other hand, the neutral theories emphasizes the roles of the statistical process um, under this framework, the homogeneity dispersal may allow the species to persist in their unfavorable habitats, leading to low species turnover among the localities. And the dispersal eliminations may cause species to be absent from their preferred habitats, resulting in high special species turnover. And as a result, the deterministic process, particularly variable selections, mm -hmm. may have formulated the uh, community assembly of soil bacteria in Kaleli. While the statistic process that the homogeneous dispersal may have played an important role in the uh, crossing the taxonomic turnover in Abalena. As for the fungi results, um, the fungi collected from all samples was primarily classified into six fila. 
and the ASCO mycota was the most dominant villain across all samples, except for the A7. It is known that the Bacillus uh, mycota dominated the A7 sample account for more than 60%. Furthermore, we found that the uh, psychomycota film was raised in the beach, with, uh, which found the highest abundance in the Apalella sharp sample. And the ecological process suggested that the dispersal lamination as to the main driver for the fungal taxonomic turnover in both two islands. And our research is still ongoing for soil chemical analysis and uh, atropo analysis. Um, we'll have more results in this year. That's all of my presentation. Thanks for your attention. Thank you, Lingzi. Okay, thank so you. You, you. You have you 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 studied all these microorganisms uh, in uh, in Albarella, which is an with the anthropic pressure, and in Caleri without in a natural ecosystem. Uh, this yes. Is, uh, so okay. You, the, okay. The I can hear is, you now. I, I remember that. We have in Caleri and in Albarella, we have quite the same, uh, quite the same index, Shannon index. Mm. So there was not a, a little bit large different. difference in number of species and even in biodiversity. But on your picture here, I see evidence of a difference, a large difference between Albarella and Caleri. Can you explain? What is this difference? The, the, the blue area is different and the, the green, the clear green too. Okay. Um, we, we can see the uh, green one means the uh, dispersal elimination in Apalella and the blue one means the uh, deterministic process in Kaleli. And I can explain uh, that the dispersal elimination may cause the species to be overextended from their preferred habitats. And the uh, variable selection means the community divergence caused by the uh, heater generals. And this result suggests that the different ecological process may underlie the uh, community assembly of soil bacteria in different ecosystems. And the bacteria community assembly in the uh, anthropic pressures uh, was more affected by the structure space than that in the natural ecosystem. Um, but the reason for such increase in structure speed um, response to environment, environment change are still not it's unclear, but might include the effect of the reduce of species pool as a result of the disturbance and the uh, structures, the colonization of the new niche spaces uh, that led to a purity effect. Mm, but I think it needs to be further researched. Thank you, thank you very much. I see, I see better now. Thank you, thank you very much.